Hello, 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 hello. This is Dirty Trucking, Dirty Trucking. Out here at the rail yard, um, waiting for the crane to come over here and put the box on the chassis. Uh, I got here at 8.49. It is now after 10 o'clock, and I'm still in here. The crane was over in the area, then he left, said he had to go do something else. So I don't know what kind of computer foolery they got here, but I've been here since 8.49. So now I just made a call in there and told her that the crane is not over here. You got trucks sitting over here. She tells me uh, my check-in time was 8.49 and that I still have nine trucks ahead of me. That's bullshit. Because the trucks that I saw that came in behind me when I checked in are all long gone. This is a new batch of trucks that are sitting in here. So we're just sitting here. And it's the same bullshit that happened at the rail yard the other day over there in uh, off of Livernois. I went over there to get a container removed. When I pulled in there, the young girl that checked me in, uh, her look at me was strange. And uh, you started the, the strange look shit. I started wondering why you looking at me all strange. So she checked me in and then tells me to take the container down to uh, Los Angeles, meaning go straight down to the stop sign. Now, I don't work at that yard. Y'all look code names for your areas. We don't know. So I asked her, what do you mean Los Angeles? She said, just go straight down to the stop sign. So I said, so you mean I don't go up to and then make that left and go down? She said, no, just go straight down to the stop sign. So I go down there, there's no crane even coming. So I bag up and go down where we normally go, at the stop sign. Now by the time I get down there at the other stop sign, a truck is in front of me, then it's me, then it's one behind me. Here come the crane, he takes the box off the truck in front of me. Then he gets the box off of the truck in back of me. And then takes off. So now I go back up to where I checked in at the end gate to find out, hey, what's going on? Am I in the right area? So now it's a young guy over there telling me, uh, you're supposed to be over in G2. Go through there. This G3, this G4, like he's giving me some, some kid alphabet game uh, tutorial. So now I saw, are you sure? Because she walked, because the girl that told me that nonsense was standing in the doorway, act like she was checking, and then just walked off. So I go over there to G2. There's nobody coming. The G2 is directly uh, perpendicular to where I was, where the crane was at when he didn't take the box off. So now I didn't call the company, ask them could they call over here, because I don't know what's going on here, but the young girl, she act like she had uh, some sort of rolling eye situation going on when I pulled up tells me to take the box down to the Los Angeles to, at the stop sign had me sit there and there's no crane coming now this guy tells me to go over to now he said first he said G2 pointing to G2 then he come back when the girl come out there said G1 to go over there and the crane to be over there so I'm sitting and sitting ain't no crane I blow the horn then finally here come the crane he pulls up to my window and tells me when I was over there in the first place he said he waited for me to go and follow him. No, he didn't. You trying to make up a lying excuse to cover up why you had me still sitting in there, which that lie is not covering up why that girl told me the wrong location in the first place. Then here come this other guy telling me the wrong location. The length of time it takes to get out of here is bullshit. Now, I checked in here at 849. There's no reason I should be still sitting here in this motherfucking rail yard after 10 fucking o'clock. And she talking about nine trucks ahead of me. It ain't no nine trucks ahead of me. Because when I log back into the system, when I checked in, it's showing that I have already checked out. So I think they are pushing trucks in front of me deliberately. And I'm getting sick of that little shit. That little young girl over there. I don't know what her problem was at that rail yard, but you better get it fixed quick when I come in there. I come in there to handle business. Don't misdirect me. Don't misguide me. Don't tell me the wrong goddamn section. And I'm now I'm not going to let you pull up to me and lie about what you was attempting to do and you didn't do. If you was trying to get me to follow your crane, you didn't do a good enough goddamn job. Because if that's what you was trying to do, I'd have been following your crane. That is not what he tried to do. He took the box off the truck in front of me, went behind me because those were two guys, and then pulled the fuck off and went straight down the aisle. He didn't wave. He didn't open his door to talk about follow him no damn where. 
Then I go back up to the check-in gate. They telling me another location to go to. Nothing but bullshit. Now I'm over here at this rail yard. We've been, I've been sitting here since 8.49. Now I think I found a container about, give me about 9.15. Been sitting here. It's after 10 o'clock. And she's telling me it's nine trucks ahead of me. The guy that pulled in behind me, checked in behind me, he got his box and been long gone over 30 minutes ago. But she's telling me I got nine trucks ahead of me. That's a nine truck lot. I have no idea why it's taking this damn long over here at this goddamn rail yard. Ain't no crane came down here at all. Period. He was over here and then pulled off and went some damn where else. And we're just sitting here running our goddamn drive time down. It don't take no fucking hour to do this shit. Now, if you got a lot of trucks, okay, it take, take an hour or so. Maybe a little over an hour, but it shouldn't even take that long. All you're doing is picking up a container, putting it on the truck. But I've been here since 849. It don't take that damn long. Period. And I'm tired of these little computer games pushing me down and down and down and down. And you talking about it ain't pushing me down. Yes, the hell it is. I watched every damn truck that pulled in behind me. They are long gone. You're not going to tell me it's nine trucks still ahead of me. That's bullshit. These cranes operate certain sides in this rail yard. You got a crane on this side, there's a crane on the other side, and there's a crane over there doing the empties. Only crane on this side is down there doing other stuff, and he ain't came down here. And the one that was down here, he done went off somewhere else. Now all the drivers is walking around looking for him, wondering why the hell we still sitting here. All these goddamn trucks are pulled up looking for the crane. We all sitting here waiting for the damn crane so we can get the hell out of here. Now this over here off of uh, 96, the rail yard over here, this is bullshit. Goddamn, how long do it take you to do your